Good evening, everyone. Well, 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 well. This is, um, I've just seen this on GB News, but rather than actually film the actual report that um, Nigel Farage just put up, I thought I'd just read what came into, into the GB News news stream just a couple of hours ago. So look at this headline. Dunkirk migrants shot in people smuggling dispute. Fighting broke out inside the Grand Synth camp in Dunkirk on Monday night with several shots fired. Guns. Guys, guns. Two migrants in the French port of Dunkirk have been shot and critically injured in an apparent dispute amongst people smugglers. Fighting broke out inside the Grand Synth camp on Dunkirk on Monday night with several shots fired. The two migrants, who are both believed to be Iraqi, have been taken to the main trauma center in Dunkirk. And local officials report a number of disturbances of the camp in recent days. The area is home, get this, to around 800 people who camp out there as they wait to be smuggled on small boats to the UK. Now, there's two things that is quite disturbing here. Number one, 800 people. And number two, small boats. They're not small boats. Some of them can take up to 40 to 50 people at a time. Have you seen how big these big boats are? They're big boats. Yesterday, we had 252 come across in seven boats. 252 in seven. On Sunday, we had 234 come across in about three or four boats. We are now approaching the summer, the summer months when the wind is down, the swell is down, and the weather conditions are perfect. But just 23 miles away from my front door, and everybody that lives in in Kent down here on the south coast, whether that be Hive or Folkestone or Dover or Deal, you know, this is scary. This is closer to us than it is Ashford or Canterbury, for example. I'm closer to France than I am Canterbury. And they're fighting with guns over there. Police were called to the camp in the early hours of Monday morning after another fight broke out. Two migrants were injured and hospitalised, but it's not known whether that disturbance involved firearms. No, probably not firearms, but sticks or bricks. These guys are feral. Yeah, they're feral. And the people smugglers even more so. Witnesses inside the camp during the latest trouble reported hearing a barrage of shots ring out before police and then medics, including an air ambulance, arrived on scene. Grand Synth, also known as the Linear Camp, is on the road between the Dunkirk, between Dunkirk and Calais. Yeah, it's on the A, A, A13, I think it is. It's not far between Dunkirk and Calais. It's probably about 15 minutes drive between both Calais and Dunkirk. You've got Calais and Dunkirk is more to the um, east of, of uh, Calais. It's on the way into Belgium. Uh, most of these in the camp are reported have come from North Africa and the Middle East. Oh, North Africa, monkeypox, anyone? The area forms one of the largest migrant camps in France and reportedly controlled by Kurdish people smuggling gangs who are known to regularly use violence against those they're in dispute with. Well, guys, I'm just going to leave that there. You see, it's hotting up already. This is one of the very first times. This is, this is going to get worse. We're not even in summer yet, and it's hotting up. Guns are being used over there now. What's to say that they can't smuggle them in over here on one of their, in brackets, small boats? It's disgusting. It's disgusting. And it's not going to stop. Anyway, on that note, like I say, I like to also, um, would like to hear your comments below. And yeah, we're at war. We're being invaded and it's not going to stop. All right, speak to you later, guys.